Break on that beat, going crazy. Hey y'all, welcome back to Tidy with Toya. For all my new people, thanks for tuning in today. If you haven't already, please like, comment, subscribe. It really helps my channel. For all you folks that are coming back, thank you. I love all the support you're giving me. Make sure you comment and let me know what you're doing. Why are you watching this video today? So right now I'm just kind of taking you through the main bedroom. Um, this is where I'm starting at. After the twins go to sleep, I'll have about two hours to do what I need to do in this space. So just giving you a before look and then once they go down, we'll get to work. So it's about 11.15, the twins are down for a nap. Um, nobody's quite asleep yet, but they're headed there. I got about two hours max to get my, my bathroom together in my master bedroom, master bedroom, tidy up, vacuum, and then I want to shampoo the floors real quick in the master bedroom. I'm starting up here because I want to shampoo the carpets. Um, so I'm gonna start in the bathroom, do a real quick bathroom clean not um, too much um, and then go to the bedroom so I can vacuum and shampoo the floor so let's get started <music> So here I'm using my Jaws um, glass cleaner. This cleaner Jaws uh, stands for Just Add Water System. It's great. Um, it's environmentally friendly. You can use it around children and pets. And I know you're probably wondering, why are you spraying this on your countertop in the bathroom? Uh, well, this is a trick that I actually got from my mother, probably by way of my grandmother. Um, but if you want your countertops to shine, um, especially in the bathrooms after you've cleaned them, just spray a little Windex on them and wipe them down. And that is what gives it that extra shine. So that's why I'm using that on the, um, the countertop.
me talk about jaws uh, the just add water system before but basically uh, you get refills um, and you get to uh, refill the bottle so you keep the bottle um, and only replace the refills um, and so you fill the container up with water to a certain level then you put the refill in and when you close it up it breaks the insert and then you can mix it all together um, I do want to let you know this is not a paid advertisement but I do love jaws and they are affordable like I have twins don't have a lot of extra money but let me tell you that these products are very affordable so um, let me know in the comments if I can provide you with that with that link um, and I'll definitely do that for you because those products are very very affordable and they smell great as well So this Rubbermaid Power Scrubber is going to get that gunk out real quick. Just wait. <laughs> And voila, the dark spot is gone. Once again, this is called Rubbermaid Power Scrubber. Um, so if I get up to 100 subscribers before the end of this month, I'm either gonna give away this Rubbermaid Power Scrubber, no, well not this one, I'm gonna order another one, but not this one, um, or my um, Bissell Steam Shot, which I will also show you today. So as I was doing this supposed to be quick bathroom clean, I noticed that my baseboards in the toilet area 
were disgusting. So I sprayed a little bit of the Mr. Clean uh, deep mist spray and wiped down the baseboards while I was in there real quick. So as you see me walk by with this uh, toy microphone in my hand, uh, my children actually have a toy, a musical toy that had this microphone attached to it. And one of them broke it off. Not sure which one, but uh, yeah, now it's broken. So mom, if you're listening, they have broken your toy. <laughs> So at some point after having twins, I decided to be more practical in how we make the bed in the morning. So now we just use the fitted sheet, um, no flat sheet, and then just the quilt on top of the bed. Um, I don't worry about matching pillowcases or anything like that because I'm really for functionality. Quickly making the bed in the morning and not having to fret too much. Um, I know some people out there uh, are very adamant about flat sheets, but we don't care in this household. I still have some just in case, you know, somebody stays over and wants to use a flat sheet. But yeah, for the most part, we don't use them. Let me know in the comments. Do you use a flat sheet and a fitted sheet or just a fitted sheet?
Um, so this spray that I am using on the wood is made by Method. It is a daily wood cleaner. Oh my gosh, y'all, this stuff smells so amazing. Like I ordered it from um, Grow Collaborative and it was on back order uh, for a long time. And so when they finally got it back, I hurried up and ordered it and it smells so delicious y'all y'all need to try it if you haven't already This is all the gunk from the vacuum, which is also disgusting.
So this is all the gunk that the shampoo picked up. Oh my gosh, that water looks so disgusting. Here I'm using my Bissell Steam Shot to loosen up all of the dirt and grime in the uh, sliding door tracking. And then I will go in with a sponge actually uh, that I purchased from Dollar Tree um, to finish getting the rest of the gunk up. Um, you can see that I'm actually cutting the sponge to flow right into the tracking. Um, to uh, get as much dirt as I can out of the tracking. Um, and I do not waste even the smallest part of that sponge that I cut off. I actually come back through with the other half of that sponge to get out the rest of the gum. But, um, this was a very satisfying clean for me.
So we are almost at the end of the video. Please stay tuned for the after shot of the bedroom and bonus bloopers. Thank you all for tuning in today and I definitely hope to see you in the next video. See you later, tidy people. Y'all, so this is what the room looks like. The carpet. Don't worry about that red stain over there. They're gonna have to charge us for that one unless somebody has a great idea on how to get that out. But this is the finished product of the room. All nice and tidy until in the morning, probably when the twins wake up. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.